Hello everyone and welcome to this New York Live Open with me, Evan FX here on YouTube. Hope you're having a fantastic day today. We're gonna go through dollar, yen, gold, silver, oil, dollar, yen, whatever you want me to cover. I will try to go through also the stock market, Facebook, Google, you know, um, or other companies that you might be wanting to look into. Tesla, for example. That would be great. So if you're here to new today, please very much welcome to you. And if you're never new here, you're always here. I do deeply appreciate that you are here today. Today, we're going to go through some, uh, some markets. So let's go. Trading forex is risky, not appropriate for everyone. Past performance is new. <laughs> past performance is not indicative of future results. Whatever's happened in the past does not need to happen in the future. And if whatever money you invest today can be lost tomorrow, so just make sure that you don't lose money you cannot afford to lose. The other thing is the risk in the market is that all of a sudden everything can crash, and I'm sorry about that, but I cannot burn. So. Let's go. Let's go CAD-Yen. So CAD-Yen today, this morning, is reaching higher. What have you been talking about? CAD-Yen strength. There it is. Boom. Boom. Uh, aloha. So where are everyone today? Like, I feel like we are a bit low today. Where are you? Where are you guys? Where are you? Where did you go? Where's your mother? <laughs> why, why are you hiding, eh? Why? Where are you hiding? So, what should we go through first? Nobody's asked for anything. Hello, Denise. I'm sorry for being half an hour late. Why am I half an hour late? Because... Um, traffic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Alex, you need to... You don't need to talk to me like a wild goose because... We should bring those people back. Hello, 4990031. So... There's two good news today. And uh, one good news is that those who were stuck on the highway yesterday uh, for 10 hours are now uh, back in business. They are now back in where they're, whatever they were. So people were stuck on the highway for 10 hours and people, uh, and electric cars went out of power and it were almost about, about to evacuate them. So, you know, always nice, you know, with... Uh, you know, with winter wonderland. The other thing is India is now accepting, or whatever, India, uh, accepting recurring uh, payments. So you can now sign up for me as an Indian on my YouTube membership. Good. Dizzy. Abbas. Pizza. Yeah. That's what happens when you get punished. Punish. That's what happens. Euro dollar. I never thought about that for an extra car. That's so scary. Yeah, uh, but there were there were civilian forces, which is not the military, which is kind of like a, a government-funded force that's supposed to help civilians in crises and stuff. They went around and gave electric cars boosters, so they got home in the end. But you know what created it? A lorry got stuck, and then for ten hours you're stuck on the highway. That has not happened since 2007, I think. So it's pretty, it was pretty bad, pretty bad. I, w I don't know what to be in that kind of situation. Oh, I'm going to be there in the end. So you never know. Um, you don't, you you never bring enough, provia, enough food for such things. So, US 30, so US 10, 10 year T note. 10 US government bonds, 10 year yield is going higher. What is that? That is risk. Oh, woohoo! Dollar is going a bit lower. What is that? That is risk. On oh, Nasdaq going higher. Risk on oh, SAP 500 going higher. That is risk. 
on. So, what's the first one? Michael, welcome, welcome, welcome. Michael in the middle, welcome, welcome. RLC Dollar was the first one to be requested for by Mrs. Sarah Star. Mrs. Sarah Star, thank you, thank you, thank you. Mamma mia, thank you. Thank you. So, higher highs, higher lows. Great. What is it today about this market today? It is... It never came back to to to, uh, to entry, but I just gonna mention that as fast as I can. Oops, that was not supposed to be happening, but sorry. So everyone now can see my account number. Anyways, I'm sorry, but uh, yeah, I'm running in profit on my account. Thirteen dollars. On my back now, I'm back at two forty four. Two forty four. That's what I am right now. But uh, yeah, so I see dollar going higher. Coming a bit lower today, right now, I would have a bit lower before going higher. But still, it is all going to the upside. Can you sell this on? No, 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 no. This is not the market for you. Uh, so, what kind of reversal is that? I don't know, that's not the reversal at all. That is just a shaboom. That is a, a reversal. That is TP, basically. So, they will sell one day. I just don't know which day that day is going to be. Okay, not today. Not today. They could have uh, run out of gas just as easily. Yeah, uh, people who were stuck could still apparently still sit in. Now the thing is, 10 hours is pretty long time for any car. I'm not blaming electric. I'm just saying that my point was, to be frank with you, my point was some cars ran out of power. If it's electricity or gas that or fuel to to keep themselves warm, to keep them some cool, to keep themselves, you know, leveled. So that was my point. The point is not to bash on electric cars. Fantastic. I've found who has electric cars. Um and I still make fun of them and with their range anxiety, but still, you know, that's enough another case. But um well that it's no way for for, for crying out loud, you know, there is going to be a winter, it is going to be cold, it is going to be a shorter range on your power, on your battery, but you expect at least when you come to a charging station that you can power up, and civilian forces came out and helped them, so, yeah, point being. Gabby needs help, Gabby. Gabby, why did you sell pound yen? Peter, well, I thought it was Peter who sold pound yen, I'm sorry. Um, uh, we can go through pound yen afterwards. Why? 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 I want this to go higher, Mister. Uh, Mister. But okay. Uh, Jazz. Howdy, how? Hello, Murat. Hello, JT. Josh. Sorry. Um, how was your? What was it yesterday you had for dinner? For dinner was it? Uh, was it the spare ribs? No, ribs and pork. Uh, no, for me, just waiting for the spike on the XY. Shout out to Sarah. Uh, gold dollar afternoon. No coco. Uh, thank you very much, Sarah. Yen group. Oh, yeah, Peter. Oh, for show. Go electric. Uh, so, you now this is to the moon. Woohoo. Uh, Euro dollar. Uh, okay. All right. Oh, yeah. That was your content there today. Um, the question becomes, what kind of experiments am I running today? Which experiments am I running today? Uh, that's the other question today. Your dollar with a new higher high. Uh, oh, sorry for that one, Mr. Josh, I think it was. Yeah, Josh did it. Uh, but uh, okay. I don't have any... I don't have any specifics on euro at the moment i'm just saying i don't know question mark it goes up it goes down it was there it was good grilled chicken today um okay yeah um so uh, so lesson number one number one lesson from josh josh says do not Hedge for the first time for for the first time 
uh, with real money. Okay, don't hedge for the first time FFT with real money. That's what uh, that was a painful lesson from Josh yesterday. So just mention that to everyone. Why? I don't know if I'm allowed to say that, Josh. But anyways, I'm sorry. But I think it's a very important lesson for everyone to know. Barty, Batir, Abdi, Karimov. So what about gold? Okay. Let me go through the markets then. Sorry. Aussie going higher. Great. Euro going higher. I don't have any trade there. Pound, dollar. What happened? Um, making a lower low. Currently bearish. Uh, maybe there is some pullbacks here. I don't know what that news is about. Uh, I literally have just been in, in traffic and I probably should have checked the news before I went. Uh, but social distancing concerns. Okay. Uh, okay. So that is still bearish. If you feel like taking it, you probably should look for entries at around one thirty two, eleven, and then twenty ish. Look at this area here. But, you know, there we go. Somewhere around there. Okay. Pound yen. Um, in my, in the A1 trading Zoom meeting I had this one, this, this morning, uh, for, was it over one hour, I think it was? We went through this and we did what? We said something about pound yen for quite some time and we'll talk about pound yen and pound yen told me that this is a range. We also defined it as bearish range. So should you be a seller here? Should be a buyer here? What should you do? What is what what, what yeah, what should you do? Well, I would say in my personal opinion without having any financial rights whatsoever. I don't like these market conditions. I don't like this market. This market is not a part of what I hope for hope to see every single day when I trade. So I would jump away uh, very fast, very quickly uh, to any kind of uh, market that looks like that. So if you tell me like you could pound the end, let's trade it, let's sell it, let's buy it, let's whatever. If you are a seller, also, sure, by all means. By all means. But I wouldn't. Gold sons, God's son, God. Oh wow, we have a God in the, in the in the temple here. Um. Oh, uh, oh, Messiah, you God Almighty, what do you have to tell us today? I have sinned. I have sinned. Please forgive me while I drink a Coca Cola. I know addiction is sinful. I do apologize. Please pray for my sinfulness. Um, okay. So, <laughs> uh, gold. So, how many gold traders do we have today? But here asks about gold. God's son asks about gold. Uh, twice. And then we have who else was asking about gold? William, welcome. How is it? It's good. Um,. Yeah. Silver says Wame. Mm, okay. Mm. 
That is what I'm asking myself every single day in December on gold. Is this market bullish? And the easy answer today is... No. Okay, goodbye. Crypto Miner, welcome back, mate. Welcome back, mate. Why, well, yeah. Oh, well, yeah. You always have to remember, it do if it doesn't happen in bed, it will happen on the chart. <laughs> uh, that is one of my most <laughs> that is one of my more famous uh that is one of my more famous uh, uh sayings by the way if you're wondering uh, <laughs> um, okay. Let's see where's my crying laughing emoji here. It's very difficult with this um search emoji. Laughing. There we go. <laughs> Quote Hashtag beat up. Hashtag I'm an FX sorry. I will probably fry. Well, should we put on the on a T-shirt maybe? Uh, because we went to my merch yesterday, uh, and maybe I should put it on the. If it doesn't happen in bed, it will happen in charts. I think that, I think that's the funniest quote I've ever said. But you know, so um, gold, no, nope. not really anything else. If you have bought this, if you sold this, well, that's totally up to you. I can't really do anything about that. That's totally yours. Um, seventy seventy five was not reached. Uh, okay, so oil is still well something there. If you know, you know. Mm hmm. Um. Uh. <laughs> well, where is it? Where is that emoji then? Then. Uh, emoji, emoji. I should probably just use use my phone instead, the kind of a thing. But uh, there we are. Urian! Get up! Go on! This is like a football team now. Come on! Yes, that's what we do. That, that's how we do it. Boom! I'm expecting this. Finally. Finally. Caddy and higher. Aussie and higher. USD and higher. New Zealand and higher! Mwah! If somebody doesn't dance now, if there's no dance party right now, I don't know about you people, but I'm having a full-on dance party over here. Okay? Why am I having a full dance party? Because we're making money! Okay, going back to, you know, being, you know, uh, cool again. I'm cool, you yeah, know. Yes! <laughs> so, New Zealand yen, what's your... Waiting for the party. Party is here, Abbas. Party is here. Party is going. Party is going, 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 going. You know? So what's my thoughts about Euro, New Zealand Yen? I love that it's making a higher high right now. I love that it's coming to fruition. I love that today I might start buying this thing. You could stop that of New Zealand yen. Why did you sell it? I haven't said you should sell it. Well, no, shouldn't you listen to me? That's what most people do, anyways. So you can pay your tides here. <laughs> yeah, how much do you need, Godside? Uh, your tenth tide. Um, how much, how, how much, I have only made today, I've only made $13 today, can, can you get $1.13? That's what I have, that's what I've made today. Uh, 
Um, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, mate. Sorry, God. It's it's a it's it, it's it's very humble. It's very humble. But yeah, uh, I hope for this one to go higher. Um, that's what I'm hoping for New Zealand. Yeah. So Denise comes in with a very important rule: never. Today's rule, never sell New Zealand Yen when stocks are going high. Why is New Zealand Yen so linked to the stock market per se? It is risk sentiment. Um... <laughs> Josh, I just, I just made, I just made it, uh, fa I just have it fun. I just, I don't, fa fast forward there, because leverage. That's because that's an offering. <laughs> So, which account number do I send it to? Uh, because banks need account numbers to send my one dollar and thirty cents. I saw because trend is down, and yeah, okay. And four hour, but daily chart we had demand level. Okay. So, if you were to sell it, and I'm being serious with you, serious with you now, if you are selling it, you should be at risk at at uh, at uh, selling level on daily, on monthly or not. So it should not a monthly trade, weekly trade. You could have sold it here, maybe. Yeah, okay, yeah, I guess, yes. But you're not right by right now. So that's kind of the thing is. Is there a correlation with stocks and FX? Yes, there is. Uh, absolutely. It's not a hundred percent, but I can't remember the 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 exact. But there is yes. So it's I use that as a combination of of information. Um, that I put out. Abbas, what are you saying now? Yeah, Abbas is apparently having a having a a small drink at the moment. But uh, what are you doing now? Looking to sell. Thirteen forty seven. Okay, cool. Great. Have fun with it. I'm not going to stop you with it. So if you want to... How much is tithe? 10%. So 10% of 13.50 is... So right now it is $1. $1 and... 35. That's what I'm supposed to pay to your bank account. Hey, yeah, give or take, so hard. Give or take. It's not set in stone, but yes, it's a good indication. Caddy and to the moon, people. Caddy and to the moon. I no, 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 no. You can only take. You can only take what I, what I, what I, what I, what I'm making, right? You can't make leverage on my. You can't have leverage. On my tenth. The US stock market is typically demonstrating a positive correlation with dollar based currencies, which means that. U.S. stock market usually rises when U.S. dollar does and fall. Um, yeah, so dollar fall, d dollar pairs goes higher when the stock market goes higher. And here we have even baby pips. What does baby say? Pips say. It's like answering the old age question, which came first, chicken or the egg? Or, who's your daddy? <laughs> um, crypto miner. Crypto miner. Are you there? Who's your daddy? 
<laughs> so I asked uh, asked a uh, daily setup uh, trader yesterday. Yes, I have daily setups. Cost the thirty thirty dollars a month, and that's why we took the caddy and trade from yesterday. Um, I asked I asked a uh, uh, daily setup trader yesterday, and I asked him. Um, I asked if he learned anything from in the in the uh, in the in the daily setups, and he said, "Well, <laughs> I don't know." <laughs> and I'm like, "Have you okay? If you haven't laughed, if you have, if you haven't learned anything, have you laughed? Yes, every time." <laughs> so, so yeah, so in so in my channel, apparently, you, get, you pay thirty dollars a month to laugh. Uh, that's of course not true, but uh, but yeah, that is <laughs> what happens. <laughs> so Godson says, let's invest in your trading strategy. I love you, channel. Yeah, very much. Um, yes, Crypto Matter, who's your daddy? Okay, I'm just going to go through my mind again. Aussie dollar higher, euro dollar higher, pound dollar down. Apparently not higher yet. Pound yet, not yet higher. New Zealand dollar seems like to me is waiting to fall uh, by all means. So just waiting for for dollar strength. So I don't know which level is gonna break or hold or whatever, but but whatever it doesn't fraud is probably gonna take it down. Uh, Crypto miner says I learn and I laugh. That's why I'm here. I love that. So for 47 people of you who are right now, please hit the like button if you feel like you've laughed today. Um, or if I've given you any new information, I have done that to God's son at least, or someone, Sulhail. I've learned something new, so. That's expressly boop that like button. You know, boop. Boop. So, dollar cat, what's going on here? Um, lower low today, new lower low today. So, we have a bank interest meeting in a couple of hours. I think it's, it's in one hour. So, we have kind of like, I don't know, we have kind of a, a theory to be done here. 58 minutes, okay? So, what should we do? Should we, should I, should we do, should I... Go through everything I want to go through. So when I'm done, I'm done. And then go live in an hour again. Or should we just have fun for another hour until the Bank uh, of Canada rates meeting is going to happen. If we are doing that, we're having the Bank of Canada interest rate meeting decision. Should we then... Uh, then we should probably change the thumbnails. I have to make thumbnails on the live. Actually for that one. So... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let let use the cat fall. So, not option number one. Option number one is uh, finish all pairs, I guess, uh, and then go live again around BOC uh, announcement. Announcement. I can't even spell English when I'm live. I'm sorry, my brain doesn't work like that. To uh, continue live until. Because if we continue live, we're gonna have a lot of jokes. By the way, it's gonna be a lot of jokes. I don't know what what how. Maybe it can turn into mentorship or like motivation or something. Or stocks. Something I'm coming back with a tithe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God's God's son says, What is your prediction for the Bank of Canada news? Okay. Yeah. Nah. That they acknowledge that they're acknowledging stronger economic performance. That means it should Open up the door for interest rate hikes. And that's going to make Canada strong. That's what I'm happening. That's what I'm hoping for. I'd have to say probably one. 
So there is currently there is three there's three there's three one at the moment. Let me actually I can actually do that. I can create a poll. Uh should we do a live continue this live? Continue this live and tell. No wait, the question is Um start a new line in okay I can't even do that uh, okay I can't okay I can't even okay finish all pairs then start a new live or continue uh should start uh, continues live until BOC announcement I can't spell announcement, sorry. Okay, it's not even Norwegian. And now... Jesus, help me. Announcement. Is that an even... Okay, I don't know. There's no red underneath that one. Ask your community. There you go. There you go. Does it even come through? There we go. Finally. Uh, I'm expecting dollar ca uh, ca a Canadian dollar strength. That's what I'm expecting. Use the czar. Pull, 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 pull. So we have 75 finish all pairs that are new live. One says, or somebody says, continue. Okay. Look at Yuri and oh my lord, how nice that is. Oh, it's just I, uh, I, it's just giggling. Finish all pairs that on your live is eighty one percent now. What's your view on gold? I want it to go higher. It's currently range. I don't. I'm not. I'm, I don't have any position open right now because it's not. It's not performing at the moment. What's my thoughts on UC Swissy? Uh, I thought it would go higher, but it's not going higher. So I'm a bit disappointed there, not to be honest. So 78, finish all pairs, start a new live around BOC, um, around the BOC, okay. I think it's nice of a fiber, it's uh, stuck for those. Is this Shutterstock? Get it. Flicker is. That's it's Flicker. Bank of Canada. Thank you. Am I free to use those things? Let's see. All rights reserved. What does that mean? Uh, no, that's not what I wanted to see. What does it mean? All rights reserved. You, the copy holder, resolve the rights by covered by law. Song rights reserved. You are free to share 
copy uh, redistribute any media money format adapt remix transform and build upon material for project okay great okay so uh 20 people have voted and what was the answer continue finish and then come back in one hour okay I will continue to finish and come back in one hour. 10 year T note is currently going higher. Risk on dollar uh, going lower right now. Risk on NASDAQ is coming a bit lower. Uh, hopefully you should have bought down here. Uh, if you don't know what you should do, then you should ask me probably. Um, so yeah, most people asked for finish all pairs to continue. S&P 500 are pretty high right now uh hopefully it will come a bit down so we can take it back up again other than that it should have bought in this area uh well or on this way here uh, and then if it goes continues to go higher you can add more but right now just wait aussie continue to go higher uh wait for pullbacks now we have broad breach structure here coming up coming down like that euro uh nothing Pound, nothing, or sell tomorrow if you feel like it. Pound yen, nothing. New Zealand dollar, wait for higher high maybe to buy it. Euro, New Zealand, nothing. USD cat should go lower, should continue lower. So any any uh, lower low right now is look to be great. And then pullbacks. Remember Bank of England in uh, 58 min in uh, some 50, 49 minutes. Aussie yen, new higher high, pull back tomorrow, continuation higher, CAD yen, continuation higher, there is a meeting soon, Euro yen, um, and I got, I got that tip there, I proved that in the, um, in the Discord channel, I sent you a photo, guys, so you can see that there, where is it, where is it, where is it, there is it, there is gold trade, uh, and I posted that photo. And I think that is pretty good. I think that's pretty nice. You know, I think that proves it pretty strongly. So there we go. Um, that was uh, pretty fantastic. And then continue higher, continue higher, continue lower, higher, high, higher, low, higher, high, higher, low. Continuation higher. I don't know if we're going to go downtown first before going higher or if we're just going to uh, visit H9 and going higher. I don't know what's gonna happen. I really want this just to reach higher. Euro yen finally has breached 128.50. Wait for the pullback. Take it higher tomorrow. This is now turned from don't trade it to fantastic. New Zealand yen very much lagging, but still maybe maybe tomorrow or later. Going in for a buy here, use the ad, maybe able to go higher. Gold um, is a no-go zone. Uh, it's range, doesn't matter, doesn't change, doesn't trend, doesn't do anything. There is no market here. US oil uh, may come back a bit down again. I'm hoping for 70, 74 or 69 area, either that or that going higher. Silver range, there is a no-go zone here. Uh, nat gas is okay, a bit higher at least, but nothing spectacularly. Also, we see range bound should probably go higher in the end. Uh, cats we see should go higher uh, later on today. Euro Swissy is not a good trade, so let's leave that alone. Pound Swissy not a good trade. New Zealand Swissy not really good trade either. Use this Swissy. Uh, no go zone at the moment. It's not performing as I would hope for it to do. So, uh, whoops, I can't click anything today. Okay. Where did that go thing then? Okay, I can't. 
Bitcoin has fallen back to support, still a bullish trend, hoping for there, uh, as long as it doesn't break below 60. Uh, Sixty-four thousand US thirty going higher. Great. Take it up. Buy whatever you want. Whenever you want. I'm not gonna tell you when and where and how. But that's what you should look up for higher. If you sell it, I'm gonna be angry with you. USDs are going higher. No going lower, so that's not great at all. F Facebook. Just going through my some of my stocks here. Going higher, great. Google. Great entry there as well. At 24, 28.40 there. Um, Tesla. Inc. Turning around again, great. Uh, Google, Tesla, Facebook. Um, is it Ravina? Rivian. Okay, ish. That would probably fall more before going higher again. But yeah, IPO higher. Always breaks the always break the open almost. So that's another one. And then what is the next one as well? Stocks. Uh, Nvidia. Tell you people. I'm telling you people. I'm telling you people. I'm telling you. Uh, copper, which we trade, is kind of a range. So soon, I guess. It's a, it's a great level to be buying at. But uh, yeah. Copper and then soybean. Waiting for that one to also to go up again. Uh, okay, cool. It's falling right now, but um, waiting for it to bottom out. And maybe reach higher in uh, I think it was January or something. November and then rising later. So as long as we're still here at twelve forty, it's probably okay. But you know, any break higher is kind of a buying opportunity. Yo yo yo, Joe Balls. Uh, I'm gonna go live in probably another half an hour. I think it is from half an hour from now on. So, just making sure we have gone through what I want to go through, and then... Okay, still. Still. Still bullish-ish. Thank you guys for joining in today. I've seen that people went away. That's kind of okay. Uh, I'm going to go over to, to the next slide, and I'm going to back in half an hour. And we are going to cover Bank of Canada interest rate meeting in 43 minutes. Okay? Boom. Have a great day.